Welcome back to Underwater Math. Today we are going to learn about multiplying decimals using the standard algorithm. Even more exciting, we get to visit Grumpy Kitty at the ice cream shop. I've got a job to do. Better make this quick. Welcome to ice cream right meow. What'll it be? I will take three scoops of your favorite ice cream, please. Great. That will be $4.49. Let me get four more of those for my friends. You've got to be kidding me. This register doesn't have a calculator. Well, it's a good thing we are here. Let's use the standard algorithm to find the cost. What is the standard algorithm? Sounds complicated. It's just a step-by-step -step way to solve a problem. In this case, we have five groups of $4.49. That's decimal multiplication. You got it. I'm technically on my break. I'm gonna need an ice cream for this. In decimal multiplication, we stack the numbers just like multiplication with whole numbers. We line the numbers up on the right, just like regular multiplication too. Absolutely. Now let's multiply. Five times nine is 45, and we carry the four. 5 times 4 is 20, plus the 4 is 24. And we carry the 2. 5 times 4 plus 2 is 22. Great, we've done it. That'll be $2,245. Not so fast, Grumpy Kitty. We need to place the decimal point now. To do this, we count the number of digits from the right that the decimal sits. And we place our decimal the same number of digits from the right in our answer. That'll be $22.45 for the five ice creams. Oh, but look. There's a sale right now. I will also take two scoops for 60% of the price, please. Unbelievable. The standard algorithm sure comes in handy here. 60% of a price is the same as multiplying it by 0.6. I got this. Line up the numbers on the right and multiply like normal. 6 times 9 is 54, and we carry the 5. Then 6 times 9, plus 5, is 59, and we carry another 5. Finally, 6 times 2, plus 5, is 17. Now to count all the decimal places in our problem. We have 1, 2, 3 digits to get to the decimal points. So we will jump 3 digits from the right in the answer. But Grumpy Kitty, that doesn't look like a dollar amount. I got you. Round to the nearest hundredth and bada boom. Impressive. We have two scoops for a dollar seventy-nine. Are you finished? Your scoops are melting. Yes, you can ring me up now. Oh goody. That will be twenty-four dollars and twenty-four cents. See you next time at Ice Cream Right Meow. And underwater math.